You wouldn't be alive today if your ancestors didn't eat meat. This statement isn't necessarily incorrect, but why are we basing our morality on the actions of our ancestors, primitive beings who had no concept of modern day morality? If eating animal products is morally acceptable because our ancestors did it, then murder and rape must also be morally acceptable because our ancestors did those things as well. It always strikes me as strange that the only behavior that we like to mimic from our ancestors is the consumption of animals. But the problem is, if we morally justify the consumption of animals because our ancestors did it, we by default morally justify every behavior and every action that our ancestors made as well. Another part of this argument that people like to use is they say that eating animal products helped us to evolve to the point that we are today and we'd still be primitive beings if we hadn't started eating animals. But is this true? And even if it is true, is it relevant? If we think about it, it makes much more sense to presume that the reason our brains developed is because we started eating and cooking carbohydrates like potatoes. After all, our brain runs off glucose and by cooking potatoes and other carbohydrates, it meant that we were able to get a stronger and higher level of glucose into our body and thus to our brains. But there are also other theories surrounding the development of our species. Some even think that it's because we started consuming hallucinogenic mushrooms that our consciousness was able to expand and our cognitive abilities were able to be enhanced. But it really doesn't matter how we got to where we are today and it doesn't matter what reason we evolved into the species and the beings that we are today. It's entirely irrelevant. It doesn't morally justify that action continuing in today's society. Nobody goes into Nando's or into McDonald's ordering a Big Mac thinking that they're going to help the evolution of our species. And if we consider that consuming animal products causes our leading diseases and illnesses, things like heart disease, certain forms of cancer, strokes, hypertension, osteoporosis, dementia. If we consider this, it becomes very apparent that actually eating animals is not helping our evolution, it's in fact killing us. And raising and killing animals is responsible for causing some of the worst environmental calamities that we are currently facing as a species. In fact, the United Nations has stated that to avoid the worst effects of climate change, the world needs to shift to a plant-based diet. So it becomes painfully apparent that we need to stop eating animals if we want to continue evolving as a species. Just because eating animals in the past helped us survive during times of food scarcity and necessity doesn't justify killing and eating animals today. In contemporary society, there is no necessity for us to continue consuming animal products. And in doing so, we're not only destroying our planet, we're shortening our own lifespan and causing an unimaginable amount of horror and pain upon living beings. If you truly care about the evolution of our species, then you have to be vegan.